Hey Earth Signs, I'm here to do your May 29th daily reading. So let's get started. Hope you guys had a really good weekend. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Okay. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. you guys have king of crystals with the magician okay king of crystals means courage and commitment magician willpower and creation Ooh, fancy sauce wow so you guys are using your manifestations and your creation you're, you're using your creation to manifest something very abundant you have the the courage to go and take a risk to start something that you thought was a little risky and you had the courage to go and do it and you are committed to it and because of that you have that willpower you are creating something very very freaking master like <laughs> you are going to create something very or manifest something huge is what I'm seeing here because of your dedication and your willpower and your commitment so that's great Libra, you guys have the Emperor. Ooh, fancy. And then the Seven of Acorns reversed. So with the Emperor, you guys are focused. You're, you have that stability. You're very focused on what you're going after. And you're, you're very tempted to go do it. You have, with the Seven of Acorns, in the upright, it means determination and stamina. But you're lacking stamina. For some reason, you feel like you can't just jump and go and do it. Okay, but you're focused and you have the stability to do it. But for some reason, I'm seeing that you're getting a little lazy. Someone is not, someone is taking their sweet ass time is what I'm saying. Maybe you need to act a little bit more quickly. Get off your butt. Uh-huh. You're focused on something. You, you want to go out there and do it. But you're lacking determination and your stamina is not all there because it's reversed. Take a Red Bull or something. Just saying. <laughs> Gemini, you guys have the chariot, discipline, and determination. And then the four shells. Soul searching and re-evaluation. Ooh. So, I'm thinking that because you uh, have dealt with so much shit in your past relationship or current relationship it's like you you've already been disciplined enough or you're feeling you've been disciplined enough like you've dealt with so much bullshit already you just want to go out there and find something that's worth waking up to now something that will heal you something that will touch your soul and dance with your soul and you're very determined to go out there and, and soul search is what i'm saying you're tired of that that drama you're tired of that or dealing with people's shit of really bad relationships you just want someone who you can hug at night and wake up without you know arguments and you just want to heal you want to heal you want to have that soul buddy your soulmate is what I'm saying you're gonna be looking for your soulmate and you're very determined to go and find him him or her Wow I wish you the best of luck and I hope you find your soulmate remember there's lots of soulmates your sister can be your soulmate your brother Sometimes people even find their twin flames, so that's even better. All right, Air Science, this was your May 29th daily. I will see you guys tomorrow. God bless. Namaste.